Hello and welcome to Yoga with Adrian. I'm Adrian and this is Benji. And today we have an awesome little yoga for when you wake up or when you need a little wake up. So let's begin right away, starting in a nice comfortable seat. As soon as you get there, start to lift the corners of your mouth just gently and we're gonna reach the fingertips all the way up towards the sky as we invite a big, beautiful stretch and a big, beautiful breath in through the nose. And then as you exhale, gentle twist to your left. Right hand comes to the left knee. Left fingertips can come behind and you wanna be careful not to push or force here, but keep it nice and easy as we begin to deepen the breath and wake up the spine. And keep the shoulders relaxed as you bring it back to center. Once again, big inhale as you reach for the sky. Spread the fingertips. Find a nice big stretch through the front body, the back body, and the sides of your body here. Reaching up to breathe in. And then exhale, twisting as you breathe out. Nice and easy here, no pushing, no forcing. Great, take a deep breath in. Slowly unravel as you breathe out and we're gonna come forward onto all fours. Nice and easy, spread the fingertips wide. Find a nice neutral spine here to start, tabletop position. Then when you're ready, inhale, drop the belly. Open your heart, your chest forward as you claw through the fingertips and press into the tops of the feet. And then exhale around through the spine again, continuing to wake up the body, the spine. And then moving with your breath, inhale to drop the belly again. And exhale to round the spine, navel draws up. One more time, inhale, feel the skin of the front body stretch. And then as you exhale, feel the skin of the back body stretch. Awesome, inhale back to that nice neutral spine. You're gonna curl the toes under. Inhale in with the soft bend in your elbows, press away from your yoga mat and lift your kneecaps up for three. Lift them up for two and lift them up for one, and then release. Bring the big toes together, knees as wide as the mat. Send your hips back, reach your fingertips forward towards the front edge of your mat, or towards your dog's paws, and then melt your heart down, extended child's pose. Try to keep nice active arms here as you bring your forehead down towards the mat, gently opening up through the shoulders, the chest, the back body, the hips. Close your eyes. If you're practicing first thing in the morning, perhaps use this moment to set an intention for your day. And then find soft, easy movement as you sway the shoulders gently back and forth, maybe massaging the forehead as you tilt the head left to right. And then bring it back to center, press into the tops of the feet. Move from your center, your core, as you come all the way back up to all fours. Then when you're ready, curl the toes under. Nice, steady placement of the hands, so strong connection of the hand to earth. And when you're ready, lift the hips up high, keep the knees bent, and melt your heart back into downward facing dog. Take a second here to really find, just reinforce that connection in the hands, fingertips, knuckles. Biceps hug in towards your ears as you begin to pedal out through the feet, the legs, feeling that full bottle body, not full bottle, <laughs> hello, wake up, full body stretch. And then on your next inhale, 
Ground down through the left heel as you lift the right leg up high. And you can imagine sliding your right leg up against a wall. So dial your right toes down, keep the hips leveled. Then take one more deep breath in here. And as you exhale, bend your right knee and bring it all the way up and through towards your chest or your heart. Squeeze and lift here, just creating a little heat. You're here for three, two, try to touch your right heel to your right glute. And then step it all the way up and lower the back knee to the ground. Keep your front knee over your front ankle here as you squeeze the inner thighs in towards the midline. And on your next big inhale, sweep the fingertips forward, up and back. You can keep the back toes curled under or you can press into the tops of the top of your back foot. Yogi's choice here, find a connection as you lift the heart up high. Inhale in, reach the fingertips, wrists all the way up and back. And then exhale, paint a wall, press your palms forward, paint an imaginary wall all the way down. And then continue to paint your mat as you pull the right hip crease back. Sending the hips back, left hip point over the left knee. Flex your right to toes towards your face or your third eye. Inhale in, exhale, draw your chin to your chest. Great, dig into the right heel. Inhale, come all the way forward. From here, you're gonna take your left toes and gently swing them over towards the right side of your mat. Then press into the earth with your feet, your foundation, as you slowly reach the left fingertips forward, up and around and back, coming into a half warrior here. Pull the pinkies back, lift your chest. Right thigh bones pulling in, just like in a regular warrior two. We find this lift up through the front, this grounding through the back. Inhale in. Exhale, take the left fingertips down to the ground. Right fingertips reach up and over. We're gonna turn the right toes in towards the center of your mat as you reach back. Gate variation. Inhale in here. Exhale, slowly bring the right fingertips to the earth. And you're gonna nice and easy use your fingertips to walk it all the way back to your nice low lunge. You'll frame the right foot with your hands. Inhale to look forward. And exhale to plant the palms and step it back to plank or half plank. So knees lowered or lifted. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, hips up high and back downward facing dog. Waking the body up with love, with a mindfulness of breath and soft, easy movement. All right, second side, anchor through the right heel. When you're ready, slide the left leg up your imaginary wall. Keep the hips leveled here. Stay rooted through the hands. Take a deep breath in. And when you're ready, exhale, bend the left knee, shift it forward, hug it all the way up in towards the heart, the chest. Try to touch your left heel to your left glute for three, two, press away from your yoga mat, and then step it all the way up on the one. Lower the back knee. Squeeze the inner thighs in the midline. Find your foundation, your alignment, and when you're ready, sweep the fingertips forward, up and back. Breathing when you land here. Finding that stretch, lifting up out of the waist. Fully present with the breath. Inhale in, exhale, paint your wall. Palms press forward, and then down to the ground as we pull it all the way back. Nice runner's lunge. Keep the right hip over the left knee, excuse me, <laughs> right hip over the right knee, <laughs> and then keep pulling your left hip crease back. Flex your left toes actively towards your face. Inhale in here, and exhale, tuck the chin into your chest. A little reverent bow. Whoo, awesome, rolling through your left foot. Bring it back to your lunge, front knee over front ankle. We'll swing the right toes now over towards the left side of your mat. Make sure you really press firmly into your foundation here and connect to your core, your center, as you rise up. Right fingertips reach all the way forward, up and back, half warrior. Pull the pinkies back, lift your chest. Breathing deep here. Nice, and then take the right fingertips all the way down, left fingertips all the way up. When you reach the earth, you're gonna turn your left toes in and find an expression here in your gait pose variation. So use your breath here to explore. 
Should feel really, really good. And then when you're ready, bring the left fingertips to the ground. Use your hands, that hand to earth connection, that grounding to come all the way back. You'll frame the left foot, take a deep breath in, and exhale to release. Palms come to the earth. We're gonna come to half plank or full plank, which is where we're gonna end today. So find length in the spine. Breathe deep here, press away from your yoga mat. Send your shoulder blades left to right. We're here for three, breathe deep. Two, soften the skin of the face. And on the one, slowly bring the knees to the earth. Come into a nice comfortable seat of your choice. Lift the corners of the mouth once again. Bring the palms together, close your eyes and take a deep breath in. Exhale to relax the shoulders. And when you're ready, we'll bow the head to the heart and whisper, Namaste. Namaste.